What is going on, everybody? It is Big L here, and today we have our play our first round playoff match of season eight of the WPF Gyarados League. We're playing Coach Pardis again. Um, he beat us in memes last week. We beat him week one. Um, he's got a super, super scary team, and I'm really nervous for this one, I'm not going to lie. My first real battle that I'm doing live com, um, and it's a playoff game. So I'm going to go ahead and send the challenge, and we'll, we'll see how it goes. Um, I sent the challenge. Uh, we're waiting for Pardis. I'll tell him in Discord that the challenge is sent. Um, and we will hop into it. If it takes him a few minutes, I'll go ahead and just cut. And um, if I really need to, I guess I, I can go over the team a little bit while we're waiting on him. Um, I am bringing an assault vest, a Raquinid, um, with enough attack investment to always break if it is max defense, max HP, uh, pre marina. I always wrote when here he loaded up. Okay, so let me make sure. <clears throat> let me let me make sure that this is sized okay. And there we go. So, and he brought he brought Kyrim, he brought Scizor, Crocodile, Primarina, Rotom, and Star Raptor. Uh, so he brought pretty much a very very similar team to what he brought last time. Uh, he didn't bring the Venusaur, which I didn't think was very good against me. Uh, uh, GLHF back to him. Um, let's make sure if he grabbed the link. He did. Um, I brought a, I brought a team that's really really similar to what I brought week one. And I don't like how similar it is. Uh, I, did, I brought a few differences. Like I said, I have uh, the assault vest on a Raquinid. I don't have webs this week. So Valley flying. So Valley flying. If you look at his team, flying stab is really really free against him. Um, Deoxys defense is just really really good. Really hard for him to break. Mega Deancey is faster than everything on his team, um, which I, I think Mega Deancey might be a pretty decent lead here, honestly. Um, he didn't bring the Blaziken. I prepped hard for Blaziken. Um, I just realized that he didn't have Blaziken. Um, Norvern was Scarfed, so it could outspeed a plus two Blaziken. It's speed tie, a plus two Blaziken. And Alolan Raichu is here with an expert belt this time. Um, Alolan Raichu isn't as important um, it was Focus Sash last time to shut down the Blaziken. We're Expert Belt this time. I still I do have uh, Encore again for that Subcom on Primarina. So, looking at this, um, I said if he didn't bring Rotom, which he did, I was going to lead Deoxys. Um, and right now I'm thinking maybe Deancey lead, maybe a Noivern lead. Um, I think Noivern is pretty free. It's a pretty good lead. I can frisk and see an item. And I can just U-turn if I don't like my matchup. Um... I think that's a good idea. I think I can just go ahead and lead Noivern. And he's still thinking about leads too, so he's probably confused. He's probably wondering why I brought a, such a similar team to what I brought last time. And believe me, I, I'm not I'm not crazy about that. I, I Pardis is a very, very good player. He's not the type of person you can expect to do the same thing against twice and hope to win, but <clears throat> and here we go. We lead Noivern, he leads Star Raptor, and I can see that he is choice star. So I'm gonna bring up my damage calc here. I wanna see. What a Draco does to this. Uh, Draco doesn't kill. Hmm. Draco has 82 to 84 to 99. He has no HP. Hmm. Okay. Um, because flying stab is really, really good against him. I don't think I don't think I want to risk get it going down because he can he can KO me. Uh, Brave Bird has a very very slight chance to KO. Um, it is a 6.3% chance to KO if he's max attack jolly with reckless. But he's intimidating. But he's not he's not reckless. He's intimidating. So he doesn't have a chance he doesn't have a chance to knock me out. So I can take a chance to get get some big damage off. The only problem is if <clears throat> if he switches out into Primarina, he gets a free. Let's see here. He's intimidate. Sorry, I'm taking my time. This is this, I think this is a really important turn. I this is why I've kind of been not wanting to do um, live com because I, I like to I take a lot of time early in games. Um, I 
I could go out to Mavis. Mavis is pretty free here. And if I just switch out... Um, if I just switch out... Um... He, got, he doesn't know I'm Scarf. So that's nice too. I can still hide that I'm Scarf. It says he's, intim he's, in he's uh, intimidated, not reckless. Yeah, I can go Mavis. And Mavis has extra bulk right now because I'm not Mega. So I'm just going to go ahead and go Mavis. I'm going to hard switch. Final Gambit. Okay. Huh. Okay. That's problematic. Um. Kind of wanted Mavis. Could have just dropped the Draco, I guess. Now comes the mind games of. Do I just go back out into air? Do I go into AirPods? Because of this bastard and everything. And if he does go pre marina, I can get a U turn off. I can U turn out into Jitterbug. Um, do I leave Raichu? Raichu's faster than everything on his team. Um, I need to see. Well, that sucks. Uh, Alolan Raichu against Crook. If he's not Scarf, Surf doesn't kill. Um... Jitterbug could be a decent... Jitterbug could be decent. Um... I don't want to get knocked off though if he does leave that. Um, yeah, I think I'm just gonna go. I'm gonna go back out to AirPods. He go. He does go to Pre Marina, and I can see what kind of he's scarf. He's scarf Pre Marina too. Okay, that's interesting. Okay. Pre Marina voice scarf. Okay, so Jitterbug is pretty free here. Um, yeah. I don't, I still would like to hide that this is Scarf. How much does Air Slash do this? Because what do I, what do I need this for? Northern, Northern's good though. Yeah, if he goes for Moonblast, he does, he definitely KOs. Air Slash doesn't do too much. Um, I'm assuming Raichu can't live a hit. Raichu lives any one hit that this wants to go for, but Discharge doesn't kill. Um. Um. Deoxys lives any two hits. Uh, I think, I think Araquanid's my best play here. I'm gonna go Araquanid. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna hard switch. I'm not gonna reveal that I'm Scarfed yet. That's why I love Frisk on Noivern. Uh, I can see that this is Scarf, which is really, really nice. It goes for Flip Trap. Okay. That's a fair play. Let's see how much. Pre Marina. Wish I was. So yeah, he's, he's, he could be, this, can he get that low of a roll? Yeah, he, he, I, I'm assuming he's timid. Um, so now we have Kyrim. Specs freeze dry doesn't kill me. Liquidation can do pretty good damage to him. I don't want to get. I don't want to let him set up for free. Um. I, 
think I, I kind of want to just... If he goes for freeze dry, I don't want him to be physical. That's the problem. I don't, if he's physical... Um, if he's physical... Hmm... I don't want to give him a free... I don't want to give him free seven. And that's specs. I live any two... I live a freeze dry if he's... He's um, be sub I kind of want to just go for liquidation. Find out what he is. Yeah, he's sub. Okay. Okay, so. According to my calcs, my min roll. He's got a lot of HP. Because my min roll should be 24.9%. Freeze dry, 35%. Okay. And he's not leftovers. Is he sub Salic Berry? That could be a problem. Um. Freeze dry did 35%. So he's gotta have he's gotta have offensive investment. Oh, that's if he's hasty. Um He's got offensive investment. Does liquidation or um, if he's at twenty five percent how what are the odds? I have a thirty seven and a half chance percent chance to break a sub. So it's a roll in his favor. And that's if he doesn't have max full. Um, shit. I don't want him to stay behind the sub. I'm assuming he's gonna have toxic. I lose this interchange. Um, not having not having the anti is really gonna hurt me. Um, I think I have to. Do my best to make sure this isn't behind the sub. I think I have to do everything I can. Yeah, this isn't ideal. He has to be max speed to speed tie Silvalli. Um, yeah, I have to hope he's not. I can't let him stay this stay behind a sub in this interchange. A Deoxys Nightshade doesn't break his sub. I think I have to just stay in. Yeah, I have to I have to hopefully Okay, I got the I got the I got the sub. I broke the sub on that one, which is good. Um things aren't looking good right now. Um, so he's, he's confused as to why that broke the sub. Um. He knows I'm, he knows I'm AV. I just, I can't let this thing stay behind the sub. I can't let this thing stay behind the sub. He has an even number of HP, too. It looks like. Um, yeah, he doesn't, he's not max HP. 
He has some. He has some HP. He might not. He might not have any HP in this one. It's still a roll. If he has no HP... It is a... 56% chance to KO. Yeah, he's gonna go for the freeze dry. Okay, so now I know that he doesn't end up behind the sub. So now I can maybe switch this out. Um, this is 24%. I can go into I can go into Deoxys. Um, because I wouldn't mind keeping Jitterbug. Um, even if it is just as a sack. Um I could just go Deoxys and click Nightshade. Or I could click Spikes. Cause he can't sub, and that's the thing I'm really, really scared of. Is him clicking sub. Um, so I think I could do that. Just go into, go into the Oxus and click Spikes. Because I can, I can, I beat this 1v1. Because he can't sub now. He could roost here though, which would be bad. Um, but even then, like I get a, that, that would give me a free switch into the Oxus. And I think I win that 1v1 because I have Recover as well. Um, and Leftovers and Pressure. So I can pressure stall him. <sighs> um, yeah, I don't want to let Jitterbug go down just yet. If he roosts here, then he roosts. Oh, good play. Get predicted. Okay. Um, does he save this is the question. Does he save this? Because I can just Nightshade and get the KO. Um, so he's sub toxic freeze dry. I think I just click Nightshade and force him to roost here. If he has roost, then I can always, I, I should be slower than him. So I can always teleport out. Okay, that's fine. I get a nice little chunk of damage on this. But that's good. I will take that damage. Uh, so... Crocodile... If he's got no HP... He's got some HP on this. Because if he was no HP, then... Nightshade would have been 30%. He's got some. I don't hold. He did 28%. So he's got like 100 HP. I think he goes for off here. Um. What do I want to? What do I want to take? So Valley can take a knockoff pretty easy. So Valley's a pretty safe switch right here. What does multi attack do though? Prima Arena. Multi attack does 6779. Um. Knockoff still does a good chunk. I could teleport here. Because knockoff is free. He brought Scarf Moxie against me last time. So he's different this time. Um. 
I could teleport. Um, because I do, I do want spikes up at some point. But what does this come in on? That's the question. Um, I could knock off is pretty free. If he goes for knock off against Tremor, what if he goes? For Foul play does. Valley, 39 to 46. Um, what does knockoff do to the rack land? Bills. But if he does go, if he does go for the knockoff into a rack it, I can get a free switch into Moivern. U turn would do a decent little chunk to this. So does Air Slash. What does he switch in on Air Slash? Primarina? Probably what comes in on Neuburn. Um. Um. Do I just let Jitterbug go down here? I feel like I let Jitterbug go down here. I either I either go Jitterbug and let it go down, or I make the aggressive play into Soul Valley. I don't like that play though, because he could have he could have Stone Edge. I mean, if he clicks that, then he really really good play. Um, I think I need to be aggressive here. I really do. I think I need to be aggressive. I really do. I'm in a bad spot. Um. Because knockoff is free. Knockoff is really free. He's at 72. Multi attack doesn't pay at all. That's if he has zero bull. He has a little bit. Um. Huh. Or do I just teleport? Teleport gets me a free switch, but it really weakens this. And what do I. What can I heal on? That's the thing. Like, yeah. What do I heal on? I mean, I guess I could heal on. I guess I could heal on Scizor, maybe? If I have no item. Ah! Uh, I could probably heal up on Scizor. Teleport. Oh, Stealth Rocks. Okay, that's fine. I can go Air Pods and just Defog. Um, I don't want those. Ones. Um, I can go Air Pods. Um, he can show me if he is. The problem with going Air Pods is it gets him a free switch into so uh, Primarina, pretty much. I don't think he wants this to go down. I can air slash. Um, uh, Cause he is choice scar. So air slash will do a nice little chunk to Primarina and it'll put it in, but a low and right you can't. A low and right you can't beat from like Which sucks. Do I just go a low and right here and just let it go down? Because what do I need it for? 
Like it can't be, it can't be Ariel. It can't be this. Like if it's Crocodile. Um, surf kills. I can click Surf pretty free. Yeah, I'm gonna go Cinnabon. I'm gonna click Surf. Um, Surf should kill. Um, I'm gonna click Surf. Um, if he saves this, then that's fair. But I don't really need this for anything. Um, cause I don't, I don't, <clears throat> I could click Encore too. If he stays in, Encore is not a terrible play. Um, if he lets this go down, I don't, cause like, I, he, he doesn't want to switch. He could switch Kyram in on this, I guess. Um, he could switch Kyram in on this. But I'm faster. And I think he's I would think he saved it for a reason. Like I can just KO it with Psychic the following turn. That would look so. If he goes into pre-marina, then that's fine. Um If he goes into pre-marina. I can live a Moonblast. If he goes into Pre-Marina, I can live a Moonblast. So that Surf damage is worth it. Yeah, I'm gonna go for Surf. If he goes Pre-Marina, I can live a Moonblast. Cool. Oh, he's Waterberry. Okay. Um, does you turn KO? That's disappointing. Um, does Flame Charge KO? No. Um, shit. Um, I'm in a bad spot. U-turn doesn't KO unless I get a crit. Air slash crit. Air slash KO. I don't have the best way to beat this pre Marina. I need to get to plus one with Soul Valley. I can U-turn. Go to Jitterbug. Sack it off, and then I, and then it's within flame charge. Range. But the problem is pre marina. The problem is pre marina lives flame charge plus multi attack. I think I, I'm in a bad spot. I think I think I can U-turn. Air Slash is pretty free though. Um, hmm. What do I do? What do I do? How do I win? I mean, Shremer, so Valley can win this game. This is weakened. I need I need damage on Primaria, and I need this to get the plus one. That's the problem. And he knows that. Uh, I think I have to go. I need to, I'm just gonna do well, losing Deancey really hurt. It me it really limited what I can. Dark Hydro Pump. Let's do this. Um, 
Okay. I'm not really worried about the damage. I think I click. I could click U turn here. I could click Defog here too. I'm gonna click Air Slash, I think. I'm in a bad spot. He's playing really, really well. I'm not playing my best. I'm playing really, really predictably. Um, he's playing really, really well. Um, yeah, I can go U-turn, and if he stays in, I can just go Jitterbug. How you turn here? If if he stays in, I go Jitterbug and sack it off. And then I can go Sil Valley and get to plus one. Okay. That's fine. I can go Jitterbug. Jitterbug dies to rocks. Um, and now I can go Shremor and click Flame Charge. I can click SD actually, I think. And then Flame Charge? That could, I could maybe just win. Hold on. Uh, so that was flying. Um, he has earth, I'm a, you gotta assume earthquake. He could have taunt too, but I'm faster. So if he goes for taunt, he wouldn't be until after I put. Stone Edge doesn't kill me after stealth. It has a small chance to KO me after stealth. Yeah. If he has stone. If I'm plus two, does multi-attack KO Primarina? Problem is if he just goes straight out into Primarina on the on the sword stance. Well, even then he has to click Hydro Pump that a Scald can kill me. Has a 31% chance to KO after Scalp Rock. I could just go AirPods here and click, uh, cause how much would it knock off from this new AirPods? Um, 31 to 37. I can click Defog. Oh, that's, this so bad. 56 to 66. He KO'd. But I can Defog. I can get rid of the, I can get rid of the rock. Do I want to do that? Is getting rid of the rocks that valuable to me? Huh. Is it that valuable to me to get rid of rock? Because it could be. It could be that valuable to me. I think he's just letting this go down, personally. I think he is. Because um, I'll be at 50%. I'll be at 50%. So knockoff will kill. Uh, but I can get rid of the rocks, get Sylvalian for free, and click Swords Dance. Is that what I do? Is that what I do? What about Rotom? If Rotom is specs. If I'm plus two, I need damage on Rotom. Ulti attack doesn't kill. But he has to be specs.
but he kills me after that. Yeah, I'm gonna go AirPods. Um, I'm gonna click Defog. I needed, I needed, I needed the, I needed. I don't think that changed much. I should have clicked default there. I think I have to go for game. I have to go for game here. Uh, I have to click SD. I, have to, I, I just kind of have to hope he throws here. I, hope, I have to hope he, like, he throws. Really. Okay, so does, does he have stone? He has rock slide. Okay, that's fine. Uh, I go for flame charge. Okay, this is dead. Um, I'm pretty sure Sizzle, yeah, Sizzle or Bullet Punch kills me here, I'm sure. That's GG. I didn't play very well. Um, pretty sure Bullet Punch just kills me here. Yeah, yeah. I, I didn't play well. I just click Nightshade until I die. Yeah, no sense in clicking anything but Nightshade. Just, yeah. All right, just click Nightshade until I die. So, that's game. GD Departus, I played terrible. He brought he brought some he brought some really good stuff though. Um, I really 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 want to win here. I really want to win here, but I, 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 don't, I don't deserve to win. I played terrible. That'll do it for the season. Um, GG to Pardis. Thanks to T4U and Big Shane for helping me build this week. Um, sorry I didn't play better. I played terrible. Um, but it is what it is. Um, but I'll probably do a draft recap, a season recap um, after all this. Um, it is what it is. You don't, you don't play well against a good player, you deserve to lose. Um, I'll have links down below to all the other content creators and to the Discord and to my Twitch. And I will talk to you guys later. Have a good one.